road trip at 6 a.m. We're in the No, I got pesos, I got pesos, I got phone. Man, they bitch, I met you like a tent. It's a 40 with 30, but I don't know what's Hash browns. Give me a hash brown and two burritos. <laughs> and then, uh, can I also get two more? Uh, burritos. At McDonald's for the second oh, time. Yep. That's chiefing. We got locked in. This is the second video where I'm chiefing a breakfast burrito. <laughs> we are going snowboarding instead of skiing. No, we're going skiing. No, I am not I'm snowboarding. Going... I'm not using a snowboard. Yeah. I am skiing. Tyler, I told you we were locked in here. Dude, I did not know it. That's chiefing. We got locked in. <laughs> <laughs> Tyler! Oh, fuck. Oh, that's fuck. God. Call John. <laughs> Your car's going on. Can I have some? <laughs> you think it's fine if I do normal braids? Yeah. Hey, uh, you got another braid? No. You automatically like. <laughs> Do you have extra socks any chance? Nope. No? No. No. Why do you not have extra socks? I'm asking you a question. It's not a asking yeah, question. Yeah, I have actually two pairs of extra socks. Okay. No, actually three pairs of extra okay. socks. Okay. Because I figured someone like you. I asked you what we needed, and you were like, No, oh, they have all the gear, dude. I gotta pee before we do this. I'm gonna pee myself from laughing. Oh, welcome center? Over there. I think we go to the welcome center. Welcome center, for sure. For sure. What are those? Um, the new shoes just came out. Yeah, like, so dumb. How do you- what is this? Harder. Step harder. Harder! <laughs> fire. There's a whole fire out here. The smoke's just getting in my mouth. I'm going down. I'm going down. I'm going down. Dude, Tyler! <laughs> I gotta do what my dad taught me. Which is... hey. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, she's down again. This is like the second. No, this is the third time I've actually fell. Oh my god, this is fast. What did it say, Tyler? Yeah, boom shakalaka, that was cool. Yeah, I saw that. <gasps> then he's down. Hey, blow up. It's smooth riding out here. How you doing? Good. Yeah. What if I brush into something? Wait, 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 wait. My skis have to be facing forward. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. I think this is for beginners. Yeah, what are you? Beginner. Falling's not the problem, getting up's the problem. Hey, blow up. No waddle. Okay. Oh, <laughs> there he's, he's down. Here comes John. <laughs> John's all right, John's all right. Oh, he speed wobbled. <laughs> Yes. Look at her go. Look at her go. Y'all see that? Remain standing. No, I think I'll do a backflip. Don't know how y'all go down those steep hills. I'm going down some like, it's basically flat. And I was flying down that thing. I felt like I had a flame going out the back of me. I might fall. Oh. 
Tyler, we cannot go down this. We can barely do the bunny hills. You see what happened last time we were on the bunny hills? Where are we going? Why did Gracious Full Sin go down it? We just went yeah. down. We went down to, not like that exactly, but kind of like that. And I just think it's crazy. I wish someone recorded it. Tyler ate shit. We're good. <laughs> Dude, I flew. I absolutely flew. Dude, I got airtime. I see it gone. We went down it again. I definitely went speedy fast. I was going to eat shit. Didn't. He only had <laughs> Poor Tyler. I hit the ground, went sliding and solid 20 feet. Er, probably at least 10 feet. Lost my ski. Dude, it was just awful. But we don't give up. Go pay the oh, fuck, this is gonna be loud, guys. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> okay, he's going, y'all. Oh. Jump. He's going, he's going. Yo, you wanna see some real speed, bitch? Just show you some real speed. Oh, he's back. Tyler, turn, 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 Tyler, turn! Ooh. Ooh. Why does he do that? Big Dipper. Oh, oh, I don't wanna fall down that. I'm about to fall down the Big Dipper. I think they would try and stop me if I refilled this with the power drink, like up there. Dude, I do not know. All I do know is we're taking a break. Tyler's got his walking taco. How's the walking taco? Busting. How's your chili cheese fries? So good. How's your whole pork? It's pretty solid. And then I got pizza and a burger. Hey, John. I just keep wiping out when I go on this. Hey, Tyler. Hey. We're going. We're going. We're going on one that I've wiped out on multiple times. All right, y'all. There you go. That is our first time skiing. Wow. If you want to skip this part, you can. That is probably the most fun I've had in a very long time. Look, Duncan water. What's going on right now with Peyton? I haven't seen you in a while, but we're snowed in. Good old Illinois. I think I found my new obsession, skiing. I'm a ski girl now. Just kidding. We don't live anywhere near a ski resort. We got our stuff, like everything seemed normal. They weren't asking any questions. Like, is it your first time? Do you need like beginner lessons? Like there was nothing there really offered. And they just kind of like handed you a helmet and skis and they were like, good luck. We go into the bunny hills and there's no one there telling us like how to do it. Like, how so we were teaching ourselves what we're doing. First time going down the bunny hill, I absolutely just pff, fall. They were like, come on guys, we're going on this hill. It's recommended for first timers. And we're like, oh my God, first timers. So we were thinking the bunny hills are not, they're barely slanted. I was like, okay, I think I'm ready to go on to the next hill. And it is not, it is not like bunny hill and then a slightly bigger bunny hill. And then it keeps going. It just went from boom to boom. Here's the hill we go after the bunny hills. Let's, let's go. And everybody's getting ready and stuff. And um, going down it and it's like clearly a bit steeper at first. It's clearly a bit steeper. And I'm like, oh, this is fast, dang. And then I can't, I realize I can't see the bottom of the hill, meaning it goes like this. And then you just see the people in front of me disappear. And I was like, oh my God. And I don't know how to stop myself. I don't know how to stop myself. I was only teaching myself. So next thing you know, I'm plummeting straight down this freaking hill. I feel free. I feel like I'm actually flying. Like it just felt like I was flying. I was like, I was ready to take off. I thought these skis were about off. I didn't, I thought it was so impressive. And like everybody down there didn't think much of it. They were just like standing in line. And I was like, did no one just see me go down that freaking hill? Apparently, it was not the hardest hill. It was not. That was for first timers. That was the easiest hill they had next to the bunny hills. 
Isn't that crazy? I made it down on my feet successfully, somehow, do not know how. And Tyler, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> this poor guy, um, he's tumbling down the hill right behind me. But he kept wanting to go again and he eventually got it down. There was another hill and we just kept like moving up hills and stuff. And Tyler came up with this really good idea. We're getting our like start off and he's like, let's go down this one. We've never been down this one. We don't know what's gonna happen. And so I was like, no, we're not going down that one. What? And everyone else was going down it. So I was like, crap. So I turned and I started going down it and they start slowing down. Some For some reason I can't slow down. I'm just like, <laughs> and I'm like, oh no, oh no, oh no. Cause I can see this thing's going straight freaking down. And I mean, it was the worst, it was so bad. And I actually did fall. I did fall. I fell on my back. I had a backpack on and I slid about 20 feet down this freaking hill. And Tyler, here he comes. He's like going down farther than me on his back. And I go, that is the best idea you've ever had. The place is not very well staffed. I don't know if there is like good staff at any ski resorts. Like, I don't know how they work. I just know like, I thought they were gonna be like, oh, you're not ready to go down this hill. You can't go down this hill. And it's like, okay, no, you could, you could fly down the freaking black diamond the moment you get there if you wanted to. There will be kids just sitting on the hill and these hills, not all of them just go straight down to where you can see the bottom. They do like zigs and zags, twists and turns. So by the time you get to the hill, there's nothing you can do. You're a noob, you can't exactly stop. So what do you do? Do you run into the child or do you sacrifice yourself and run into a bush? I don't wanna hurt a child. So I kept sacrificing myself. And this has happened multiple times where there are just kids sitting in the middle of the hill. They're not like changing their, like trying to even get up. They're just sitting there like talking. And you're like, why are you talking in the middle of the freaking mountain? Like, what are you doing? And you just absolutely murder yourself. You, ju you just off yourself in the freaking side and they're sitting there talking. They're like, back to what I was saying. There's no one there like, hey, get off the hill. There's no whistles. You can do whatever the hill you want. Or like, let's say they fall and they're on the side of the hill trying to get their stuff ready. They don't look behind them and go back on. Like, I realized a couple of adults don't do that. Like they did not look behind and get back on. They were just like, my skis are on. And they would go back out right in front of me. And I would seriously be like, watch out. Cause I'm flying down this hill. So I would scream, watch out. I jumped over someone. Cause he goes, huh? And then he fell again and I jumped over him. I'm telling you, these people are like, <laughs> They're stupid. It's scary. It's just scary. Majority of the reason why I fell was because there was people in my way. And I'm not even kidding. It wasn't because I lost my balance. Um, me losing my balance and falling was probably a good less than half of the times I fell, actually. 30 miles per hour down this hill. And you're just standing there. There will be more ski vlogs coming because we're definitely doing that again. We all had a great time. Tyler ended up with a welt on his side like a horrible bruise absolutely horrible bruise i was so shocked when i saw it um his whole hip is just like purple i hope you guys enjoyed the video and yeah goodbye